chief investment officer his name is Vijay Valicha and he represents Century Financial Vijay welcome to big biz thanks ani and let's let's talk business let's talk business so um who else can speak of finances and investments and stocks and uh, you know loans and i don't know what i think the best person is vijay valicha who is the chief investment officer century financial so let's get to know century financial from you vijay so sunny century financial is a 30 year old organization we were one of the first organizations to introduce finance to this country uh we actually are consultancy firm we okay. help people to actually make in, uh, investments across the world all right so whether it's a 21 year old who's just starting his job whether it's a 59 year old who's at the cusp of retirement we help investments for all all people so you're saying that if i have funds right now lying in my account and i don't know how do i how do i invest it where do i invest it what do i do with these funds or if my funds are diminishing due to the recession i need consultation you guys are the people i need to go to absolutely we are the people to come to also if you don't have funds to invest right now how to actually generate those funds we are helping in that as well also loans we don't do loans but of course you know it's important that everybody should have savings so how to actually create those savings we help in that This is the Big Biz with Sunny on 106.2 Big FM. Well, a second of silence doesn't mean that the show is over. The show has just begun, my friend. Mera naam hai Sunny. This is Big Biz. आ जाता हूँ हर रोज संडे से लेकर वेंसडे 11 से लेकर एक बजे तक और मेरे साथ है मेरी शो प्रोड्यूसर शास्त्रा और आज हमारे स्पेशल गेस्ट है विजय वालेचा, who is Chief Investment Officer, Century Financial. Today we are talking about uh finances we're talking about investments we're talking about how is the year panning out and if you have any questions related to your finances if you want to invest if you need guidance if you need counseling vijay is the man vijay how are you doing i'm doing good how are you not bad vijay vijay aapke favorite gaane baja raha hu main yahan par thanks yeah the energy is good out here it's very good but how is the energy of 2020 in terms of finances obviously not too good Let's get to know more about that. Well, the energy has been unbelievable, not always positive, but it's been a hell of a roller coaster. Right. So 2020 as a year has been uh, a turbulent year not just for individuals, it's for organizations, it's for employees, employers alike. Um it's also been the same for people who are just out of college. It's been for people who've uh, evolved with the times when it comes to work from home study from home 2020 has been a paradigm shift isn't it absolutely so i got out of college in 2007 and 2008 this happened i can really understand people who are just out of college and thinking ki how can we ever find a job in this situation well that's that's someone uh, like shastra who can answer that right shastra you were just out of college and she like okay hmm okay ha pandemic okay hmm <laughs> hmm kya kiya jaye right? exactly bahut relatable lag raha hai mujhe ye sab <laughs> so let's talk about century financial let's talk about uh, vijay um from an employee's point of view from an employer's point of view और जब पैराडाइम शिफ्ट है जब इन्वेस्टमेंट्स की बात आती है सेंचुरी फाइनेंशियल की रेलेवेंस और भी बढ़ गई है बिकॉज इट्स एन इंस्टीट्यूट दैट टेक्स केयर ऑफ फाइनेंशियल नीड्स एंड कंसल्टेशन लेट्स टॉक अबाउट प्रोडक्ट्स लेट्स फर्स्टली टॉक अबाउट ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी एज एयर Absolutely, 2020 has been a roller coaster for the markets. We have seen the markets crash. We have seen the markets make a new high literally yesterday. So we actually are seeing unbelievable things this year, which things which we you know any professional who has been for 20 years would have said कि ये तो I would never thought of. Exactly. एग्जैक्टली तो एम्प्लॉयर के पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू से बताइए एम्प्लॉयर्स ने यू नो लॉट ऑफ ऑर्गेनाइजेशन टू सेव गार्ड देम सेल्व हैव टेकन डिसीजन लाइक रिड्यूसिंग सैलरीज और लेइंग ऑफ और वर्किंग फ्रॉम होम और यू नो पेड लीव्स को काटना सो ऑन एंड सो फोर्थ बट वेन इट कम्स टू सस्टेनेबिलिटी वट इज सेंचुरी फाइनेंशियल प्रस्पेक्टिव ऑन दिस सो द आइडिया इज ऑफकोर्स एम्प्लॉयर्स हैव टू हैव बीन एक्चुअली टेकिंग हार्श डिसीजन नॉट द वंस दे रियली वॉन्टेड टू टेक बट अगेन दे बीन फोर्स टू टेक दम work from home and, and office going away probably is a very good thing of the entire pandemic right but besides that i think uh, it's been a bad situation for all employers and employees like so what would you let's talk about employers to begin with what is that financial tip that you would want to give employers who right now are is jag to jahad mein hai ki okay you know what what's my next step what should i be doing So the idea is uh, in any kind of a business what you have to look at is working capital right as long as your working capital is uh, maintained you shouldn't be trying to lay off or trying to be actually you know uh, cost cutting see because situation is bad there's no doubt about it but we know this is temporary I and mean, hopefully it's temporary right so of course as long as your working capital is met uh, you shouldn't be laying off or you shouldn't be actually you know uh, downsizing okay let's talk about agar working capital abhi questionable hone laga hai especially for the past 6 months aur yahan pe sawal khada hone laga hai ki okay you know what okay i might start getting the pinch in the next quarter what should the strategy be 
the strategy should be actually to have a big savings buffer so what actually the pandemic has taught us that individuals as well as companies should always have a decent enough savings buffer because the it's always taught in business schools that you know you should have always a two years buffer of uh, capital spending right. but that's something which nobody ever follows and people always tend to ignore it it's actually something which we have learned that it is something to be followed very very rigorously ha but uh, you know bahut sari organizations ne wo do saal ka buffer liya bhi tha par ye ehsaas nahi hua tha ki is saal mein aisa mod aayega jahan par wo jo do saal ka buffer hai shrink ho kar 6 mahine ka ho jayega aise mauko par uh, advice hum aur aap se lena chahenge probably we can just probably you know if you have any calls or if you have questions like this where you're stuck in this kind of a rut all you can do is you know call and i'm giving you a consultation with vijay valecha personally वेल चल रहा है बिग बेज वे वी सी लेट्स टॉक बिजनेस मेरा नाम है सनी एवरी डे इज अ न्यू डे एंड दिस इज अ न्यू शो ऑल टूगेदर ब्यूटिफुल मंडे मॉर्निंग इलेवन थर्टी वन This is the Big Biz with Sunny on 106.2 Big FM. और आज की मेरी स्पेशल गेस्ट है विजय वलीचा, who is the CIO, Chief Investment Officer. Uh, विजय, what is a Chief Investment Officer? Well, a Chief Investment Officer, someone who helps you invest. गिव्स यू द राइट गाइडेंस के कहाँ इन्वेस्ट करना चाहिए कब करना चाहिए एंड मोर इम्पोर्टेंटली क्यों करना चाहिए राइट सो यो सो दिस इज प्रॉब्लम द टाइम यू नो कुछ ही देर पहले शास्त्रा वी वो टॉक टू विजय एंड विजय से हमने पूछा था कि यू नो अयर ऑफ लाइक ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी इज इज अयर ऑफ लर्निंग फॉर लॉर्ड ऑफ पीपल दिस इज नॉट जस्ट फॉर एम्प्लॉयर्स एंड एम्प्लॉयज इज वेल जहाँ तक एम्प्लॉयज की हम बात कर रहे थे आपने बोला था कि uh, एक दो साल का कैपिटल लेके चलना चाहिए जो ऑब्वियसली वो जो कैपिटल है uh, इस साल के आते आते श्रिंक हो गया तो लोगों ने स्ट्रैटीज बनाई किसी ने डाउन साइज किया किसी ने ओवर हेड कॉस्ट कट किए किसी ने आउटसोर्स किया इट्स नॉट समथिंग दैट इज एडवाइज बट ऑब्वियसली दिस इज समथिंग दैट पीपल हैव डन एंड देन यू मैंशन अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू विच वॉज री असेस एंड री स्ट्रक्चर हाउ वुड यू डिफाइन दैट वेल द होल आइडिया इज इट्स वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट दैट एवरी कंपनी डज री असेस एंड री स्ट्रक्चर एवरी कपल ऑफ ईयर्स दिस पैंडमिक डेफिनेटली हैज बॉट इन इट बॉट द मेजर कॉन्सेप्ट कि आज के टाइम पर जरूरी है करना so of course the idea is that every process actually going through a company has a lot of overheads has a lot of wastage that can be really trimmed down rather than cutting down your staff it's much better to cut down the wastage right so reassess or restructure ko jaise agar main samajhta hu i've seen organizations who haven't had a lot of people walking into their stores as retailers what they've done is they've gone digital right uh, they've got taken their product out online and they're like okay you know this is available they've invested in digital they've invested in digital marketing forums where their product is constantly there where people are like you know have their smartphones in their hands they have they're in front of the laptops and the product is there stating that if you can't walk into a store you can definitely log in here and buy that product right that would be reassess and restructure in a way absolutely so also for the lot of service based companies dubai has a lot of service based uh, industry and the service based industry can definitely be working from home uh, does not require the most posh real estate you don't require the biggest office so those are simple costs that can be saved by a company okay so uh, you know shastha there are a lot of questions coming in there's one of the questions from an individual's point of view do you have a question that you want to ask vijay yes there is a question from sana she says what are risk free investment options well actually that's a very sad question because the answer is actually very sad uh, risk free investments hote nahi hai there's so nothing which is risk, absolutely risk free risk free investment is an oxymoron absolutely the idea is <laughs> all investments even savings are not risk free okay neither earnings the idea is uh, yes there are less less risky investments like like fixed deposits when you can actually think of bonds treasury bonds government bonds those are less riskier than other investments but at the same time risk free nahi hota hai the most important thing is to assess what kind of a risk appetite do you have where do you want to actually invest and what kind of returns are you looking for in the future employee ke point of view se shastra you know uh, like already employer ke point of view se vijay has mentioned ki you know the couple of pointers that we mentioned but from an employee's point of view what would be the ideal for example if i am at uh, at a risk of losing my job um and what uh, what would put me what is the kind of investment that i need to have a saving that i need to have uh, that could safeguard me i mean me kitne mahine ka hona chahiye stock so that i can be safe well a savings buffer which each individual should have should at least be 6 months of their salary all right or 9 months of their entire expenditure Thicke. so either which way is the uh, that is something which everybody should be having as a savings buffer again it's not very easy to create product right from the start but it's again again like a wake up call so if we actually start working towards it now at least an, if a problem comes in, in the next few years we won't be facing it again or uh, so this is a good learning or agar na ho to agar na ho to we have to trim down costs like uh, for companies they have to reassess and restructure so to people 
सो डू पीपल पीपल नीड टू री एस एस वी स्ट्रक्चर लाइक अपने अपने रेंट को कंट्रोल करो या एक ऐसे ऑप्शन में जाओ जहाँ आपका खर्चा कम हो जाए घर में अगर दो तीन गाड़ियाँ हो तो उसे लिमिट करो ट्रैवल uh, अगर आप करते हो और लैविशली स्पेंड करते हो तो उसे लिमिट करो ये सारे ऑप्शन की बात करो री एस एस एंड री स्ट्रक्चर नॉट जस्ट फ्रॉम अ कंपनीज पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू बट फ्रॉम एन इंडिविजुअल एब्सोलूटली इंस टू द पैरिस ट्रिप टेक ओमान ट्रिप इंस्टाफिंग थ्री कार्स है वन कार इंस्टाफिंग फोर बी एच के है वन बी एच के द आइडिया इज ऑफकोर्स Uh, come down to bare minimum because that saying buffer is much more important. The big biz chal raha hai Sunday to Wednesday 11 se lekar 1 baje tak aur mere sath har din ek special guest hote hain leading entrepreneur a business leader a people who inspire and encourage us even through a situation such as this because we cater to businesses we cater to consumers right there. And today I have Vijay Valecha who is the chief investment officer Century Financial Vijay how you been how you finding it? Uh, it's amazing of course. You're co-hosting the show with me. Yes of course and that's why it's good. Yeah you you know a while ago you just said that you're a big Barca Barca fan right? Correct yes. Yeah main bahar ka fan hu. Mujhe football is something you know I you know what I love football. Yeah. You know I love the shape of it. But uh, everything in and around it I'm a little naive. Correct. Right? Okay we're talking about investments and you're the right person to uh, answer all our queries. We have employees, employers Everyone who has relevant questions related to investments and finances they've been messaging us here's a question that's come in and the question goes like this I want to know what is the best way to invest minimum amount with maximum returns like I have always read about Amazon shares is it worth it says Sheel please what would you want to say so Sheel uh, most important is not the amount but it is the risk reward ratio So when you look at maximum returns you're also looking at a maximum risk profile. Right. The idea is always to keep uh, the risk to a minimum rather than you know trying to maximize returns. When it comes to Amazon shares, yes, definitely I feel Amazon shares are definitely worth investing even at current market prices even if it goes a thousand dollars higher from here. It's a product that all of us use and always invest in companies that you use yourself that you actually believe in. So yes Amazon is something which I use on a daily basis ever since the pandemic I've never been a shopper but I've gone into the online shopping spree and every day I have to buy something from Amazon right so of course I completely believe in the company and I do believe that the shares even right now are rightly priced to actually get into it all right so agar uh, to agar aur options bataye jaye uh, jahan par investment minimum ho aur returns maximum ho aur kya options hai hamare paas so there are many options as such equities of course offer the highest uh, uh, barricade for maximizing returns but a person should realize that you should have a portfolio you can't have just one stock or one company or just equities you're supposed to diversify portfolio into bonds also into commodities you're supposed to look at even safe investments so it always comes down to of course your age your demographics the stability of your job all of those matter but most important is no matter how stable your job is and no matter how young you are you need to have a portfolio rather than one stock Makes a lot of sense. There are a lot of other questions coming in. Uh, let's go to the next question, uh, Shastra. What question do we have, and who's asked it? Uh, the next question is from Ramesh, and he says, "When and why should one start retirement planning?" So retirement planning is something that okay, you have to start because, just like life and death, retirement also is certain. Right. It is something that we all uh, definitely have to go through. And for all of us, what we wish for is that we have a good retirement, a early retirement, a good one. The earlier you start the earlier you can retire like I was telling you if you actually start planning it now you can retire at the age of 45 right if i actually if i actually start planning it now i'll retire at the age of 60 so i would rather you know have a good early retirement where i can enjoy my retirement have fun with it enjoy spending my money there so the earlier you start the better it is for sure this big is the big biz with sunny on 106.2 big fm where we all come from various fields uh various facets of life and uh It all narrowed up, narrows down to how successful we can eventually be, and we're at Big Biz. This is 12:30 on the clock. It's a beautiful Monday afternoon, 24th of August. Or Big Biz, maybe we have a leading business personality every single day. Today, Vijay Valicha is talking about finances, investments, and what not. Vijay, maths always uh, was something that you were driven by, right? Definitely. I mean, coming from an engineering background, maths was the only part that I enjoyed in engineering. और राइट एंड यू नो वट आज आपने काफ़ी सारे रिलेटेबल सवाल आपने सवालों का जवाब दिया आपने एंड जाते जाते आई वॉन्ट टू आस्क यू वन इम्पॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन वट इज ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी वन लुकिंग लाइक सो एक्चुअली गिवन द फैट दैट ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी इज बीन सच अ रोलर कोस्टर आई थिंक ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी वन इज लुकिंग टू बी रियली पॉजिटिव एक्सट्रीमली आई मीन द बेस्ट पार्ट ऑफ लाइफ इज दैट वॉट कैन गो वर्स फ्रॉम हियर 
एग्जैक्टली राइट एग्जैक्टली वन वीव ऑलरेडी रन रीबूट एंड वीव ऑलरेडी इवॉल्व थ्रू द टाइम्स एंड वी यू नो ये छः महीनों में इतना इंट्रोस्पेक्शन हुआ है ना दैट वीव एक्चुअली रियलाइज कि हम कहा कौन कहाँ पर अपनी गाड़ी स्टीयर करना चाहते हैं राइट right? और इसी को हम आज समाप्त करेंगे बिग बिस के थ्रू आधे एनी आधे क्वेश्चन शास्त्र दैट पीपल है वास्ट फॉर इन्वेस्टमेंट्स और फाइनेंशियल रिलेटेड स्टफ Well, there is one question that right. I think is relevant: is what is your outlook on the Indian rupee, and what should our Indian listeners need to know? So, what's the outlook uh, again, loud and clear? What's the outlook on the Indian rupee? Indian rupee, yes. And what should the Indian listeners need to know about this? Yeah, but I. So, of course, uh, every Indian should know this: that the Indian rupee is diminishing and will probably continue to diminish. So, we should be seeing around eight percent cut on a yearly basis. So, this year is no different. The pandemic has not changed the Indian rupee outlook. Indian rupee remains to be weak, and we can see it probably hitting 80 levels in the next year. All right. Okay. So the only objective over here is is steer through times and see how you can reassess and restructure your business at this point of time. Absolutely, that is something very very important uh, when it comes to investments for Indian listeners. Uh, a lot of indian listeners actually a uh, lot of indian investors actually get into just investments in india that's something that people should be really careful about that all your investments should not be in india also while we're looking at diversification through asset classes it's also important to have diversification through geographical locations okay aur aaj jaate jaate ek biz word biz word hota hai aapke uh, business related what's that one word that you want to share with us that uh, people can get acquainted to Well the one word I would like to share is leverage okay leverage is a very powerful and very very deadly tool okay it should be used with the right sense it should never be overused because over usage of leverage always causes trouble that's that's insightful that's insightful mere sir ke upar se kya but uh, <laughs> i'm going to leverage on that thought and bounce into this one and i really thank you for joining us vijay uh, it was great having you here um chief investment officer Century Financial for all your queries you can log on to their website and we'll be right back stay tuned thank you vijay well that sums up our session for big biz for the day and as we spoke to vijay valicha who's the chief investment officer and he spoke about a lot of insightful information related to finances when it comes to investments and everything around it uh, vijay jaate waqt if someone wants to get in touch with century financial the website would be uh, century.ae and by going on century.ae they can get all they can get to know the products and what they can invest in right absolutely the products uh, our live webinars also more importantly our next seminar sessions where if anybody wants to have free training we have it on a weekly basis anybody can register online and can walk into our se- seminars excellent and what's the contact number if they want to actually get in touch it's 04356280 i'll repeat that it's 04356280 for any of your finance related queries whether you want to invest somewhere what do you invest on how do you do it and what's the scope everything can get answered by century financial 04356280 thank you again vijay thanks sunny